Welcome back gamers, Lazy Gamer here, and let's play some more Knights of the Old Republic. And I am going to get someone killed, at least if I can do it, do the thing correctly. Yeah, if you watched the previous video, we met a woman who knew Jolie. And her husband is in jail for for mur murder, and we have to prove him innocent, and or at least if he did it, try and uh, get him acquitted. Anyway, what is? Oh, it's just something. That I can't walk on. Just part so, of the. Um, do we have a deal? That's an awful lot of money. Is there something you're not telling me? Don't be so suspicious. The Republic is generous. We pay our mercenaries well. Makes sense, I guess. All right, I'm in. When do I start? Just show up at the Republic Embassy tomorrow and speak to our representative there. I'm sure I'll have some task he wants you to start on right away. Hmm, the mercenaries, huh? Mind. I'm in the middle of a Republic recruiting drive right now. I need to hire these mercenaries before they sign up with the Sith. Good. Yeah, I'll the be going. I spend talking to you, the less time I have to talk to the Mercs. Yeah, good point. Let's see. This goes. I have no idea. Because the marker is at the end. This. Why? Not so true on there, yeah. What are you talking about? What do you want to do? Why do you need me for this? I guess. Yeah, but let's let's keep uh, our eyes. That's true. to investigate them. I 
I shall look into it. Yeah, fine. But I was really in the middle of a murder investigation. I, I don't think it's really timed, but I would like to actually get it done. So this is High Court. This is holding cells. This is the central. I think the hotel is on the other side. So let's try and uh, speed it up slightly. West Central. Here we go. Now let's see. This is West Central. I think the hotel is over there. Yeah, that's the wrong way. Here we go. East Central. Now Well never mind. East and west so always confused. things are going to happen, I think. Save your empty threats, Sith scum. Malik isn't stupid enough to attack the core worlds. Now with the entire Republic fleet waiting for him. You're a fool. You and the Sith descend on Coruscant, our numbers will block out the sun itself. The galactic senators will collapse trembling in fear and beg for mercy at Malak's feet. You underestimate the Republic's resolve. We'll die before we surrender Coruscant. That can be arranged. Remember what happened to Taris. Malak could do the same to the core worlds. He wouldn't dare. Now it is you who underestimate our resolve. Right. Uh, Republic versus Sith, I guess. Let's see, this is... This is... Shop. Not going there. Um, security drone. This goes to something hard to read. I think it says hotel. Yes, it does. And then we go there. We have to talk to some people here. Let's You're talk the with this one guy. defending Sunry now, huh? Well, the hotel's open for you, and I guess I gotta answer any questions you want too. Um. Tell me what you saw. The Sith woman, Alasa, rented a room in the hotel. An hour or two later, Sunri comes in and goes to her room. A couple hours later, I hear a blaster shot and see Sunri running. He can't run good because he's a cripple, but he still was going pretty fast. I would swear he started after the shot, though. After the shot, huh? Could have gone off after no, he left? I don't think so. I mean, it's possible. Just barely, but I wouldn't say that to the court. You could testify it happened after he left. No, 
No way I'm lying to the court just because you want to get your Republic buddy off or whatever. I have no interest in going to prison. That's, That's a, a lot, lot of money. money. Maybe I could do something for you then. All right, I'll do it. I'll tell the cell cat that he left before the shot went off. But this is our little secret. If you try and turn me in for lying, I'm making sure you come with me. Hmm. I guess this is what they call working the system. Not that I'm objecting. I just hope the cell cats don't find out about it. Now, was there anything else you wanted? Uh... Elasa used to rent rooms here every week or so. Then Sunry would come by a couple hours later and stay all night. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what was going on. There were only two other people in the hotel when it happened. One was a Rodian named Glupor. Seems like a really dirty, shifty type. Normally, I don't let his kind in here. I'm a reputable businessman, you know. But there weren't many people here, so I decided to take a chance. The other is a regular named Feareth Me. He's a Pazak player. Probably an addict, but he claims he's big in some circles. Don't know anything about him other than that. Anything else you want to know? Nah. I just thought it's... Yeah, you used know to about them. Here every week or so. Then son, it doesn't take. Yeah, you said that. Never mind then. Yeah, I won't get any dark side or light side points anyway. So. Doesn't matter. Uh, people, people actually live here. Yay, that's the you guy. You here to see me about the murder, too? I told the damn fish everything I knew. What more do you all want from me? What do you know about Sundry and... Uh... Sundry, I only heard of once or twice in passing. Some sort of old-time war hero against the Sith. Seen him around in the hotel, too. Going to Alas's room always, of course. Kept the rest of the building up half the night with their damn antics, usually. <laughs> They were having a relationship I'm not then. Like that. What they did in that room in private is their business. And there isn't any rule against Sith and Republic seeing each other for personal reasons. Although if you think her Sith master didn't know, you must be fooling yourself. Sith uh, master? Well, Alasa was a Sith, so of course she'd have to have someone above her. Yeah, I, I didn't see anything. What did you well, see? One time, I saw Alasa coming in wearing this big cloak. I was on my way to my room, and she normally wears stuff like that, so I didn't pay her too much attention. But this time, I accidentally brushed up against her. Accidentally, of course. And her cloak fell open. Now, I don't have any qualms about the Sith. I leave them alone, and they leave me alone. And seeing as how Alasa had a Sith lightsaber under her cloak, I'm not going to poke that hornet's nest. She was a dark Jedi then. But I'm not getting myself in any further with the Sith. I know how ruthless they are. Now that's all I'm going to tell you. I'll testify to the court, but you aren't going to get anything else out of me. Right. Then there's the other guy, if I can ever... Yes? There we go. He was there. Hey, guy. Why were you in the hotel? What did you see? Well, that's suspicious. 
Uh, what about her room? Did someone pay you to do something in that room, Lupar? Uh, obvious. Right. Not sure if that went according to plan, but uh, yeah, like I said. <laughs> get him killed, aren't I? Uh, mysterious man. Jedi, I hear you are investigating the Sunray murder trial, I wrote. This case is not at all what it appears to be. The many currents, might I say, flow beneath the surface. This murder is much more complicated than it may first appear. The Sunray and Elasa are proxies for their governments, and both sides want the other to fail. You can see the journey uh, by the footprints. You are... Uh... Huh? I'm saying they both had something to do with it. They both kept their hands in this from the start. If you want to get to the bottom of this murder, you might seek information from both the Sith and the Republic. Yeah, there's some bug here, I think, so it might... And I've been... Heed my advice, Jedi, and you may yet find the truths in this murder. Uh, anyway, um, this is Republic Embassy. All right, security drone. I don't need to see that to do... We'll go back here later. There's a man of evidence there if I want to see him uh, actually um, found guilty, so... Where does this go? Somewhere totally... Courtyard. I don't think we need to go there anyway. Let's focus on the things at hand. Um. West Courtyard. Um, and then this way, let's talk to uh, Alta West. I hear you've been Talked appointed as arbiter in Sunry's trial. My husband is innocent. Please don't let him go to jail for a crime he didn't commit. Talk to him, say anything about him? He's a cripple. There's no way he could have overpowered the Sith woman like they claim. That's true. I'd forgotten about that. Let's not forget that he would have to have been considerably older than the Sith woman. I'm a Jedi, and 
Someone who was living alone in the Shadowlands until recently. That keeps you in shape, damn it. We're talking about Sunry here. And there's no way he would do something so dishonorable as hit her from behind. Sunry's a decorated war hero. He's a hero of the Republic. Well, Find the real him. evidence. That's all I ask. The real evidence will prove Sunry didn't do this. I hear um, you've been appointed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was Sunry having an affair? Uh, of course not. He, he, yes, yes, he was having an affair. He was seeing that that Sith woman. After all these years we've been together, he just, just dropped me like that. Not publicly, I know, but inside, that's what it feels like. I started seeing Alasa last year. I, I had my suspicions for a while, but. He was careless. Pretty soon everyone knew. But even though I'm sure that Harlot was only using him, I know he couldn't have killed her. He came and confessed to the affair to me. He said he was going to there to break it off, to end it. Maybe the Sith woman attacked him and he had to defend himself. But even though he cheated on me, inside he's still the man I loved. Yeah. He's too kind and gentle to have killed her. Uh, I can... Find the real evidence. Uh, I leveled. Well, let's ignore that for now. I think I can go and see him now. him first he's prisoner I would assume he has a name mission really Jolie Sunry what are you doing here the Lord sent me Sunry I'm here to get you out of this mess the courts went and made us arbiters for your case just like old times eh Jolie you come swooping in out of nowhere to save my tail from the fire? You saved my wrinkle butt more than a few times as well, friend, if I recall. But there'll be time for catching up later. Right now, we need to focus on the case. The case is a complete fragment. Anyone looking at the evidence could see that. So I thought. But the cell cast seem to think that there's... Well, that there's enough to go to trial. There aren't any witnesses. All that evidence against me is circumstantial and completely flawed. Go over it then. You know I was having an affair with Alasa. I went there to break it off that night. But I can tell you it wasn't easy. She is... was young and beautiful. But I love Alora. I knew I had to do it. I broke it off quickly as I could and then I left. I found out later she'd been murdered when the Selkath authorities came knocking on my door. But let's look at the facts they've given. Alasa was brutally killed. Think about that. She was a Sith. Trained in battle, and I'm just a crippled old man. My war injuries make it difficult for me to walk, even to hold things. See how my hands are shaking? How could I kill a Sith warrior at close quarters? I ask you. Further, they say they found my heroes cross at the crime scene. Could I leave my war medal behind if I killed someone? Even I'm not that stupid. Obviously, the Sith planted the cross. And what about the lack of forensic evidence? Skin and hair samples, clothing fibers. Why isn't there anything like that at the crime scene? Sounds like an obvious frame up to me. I hope you can see how the Sith are manipulating the cell cat, and probably even you to set up this against me. We need to get this over with quickly and clear my name. Anything else I can help you with? I want my arbiter to be well prepared before we go to trial. Hmm, need to investigate some more. A few cases we have to clear up. Very well. I suppose there is still much you must do before the trial. Once you've gotten enough evidence to go to trial, just tell the warden we're ready. The sooner I get out of the cell, the better. Sunray. 
You're going to prison. I think. <laughs> I don't think I can make it stick, but we'll try in the next video. In the meantime, this was your host, the Lazy Gamer. Logging off. Bye, guys.